In this video, we'll be sewing the Yaya Han jacket from McCall's 7765 UB, as seen in these photos. Since I sewed this as part of a design challenge, I made it out of a curtain that is part embroidered organza, part crinkle polyester. The binding is made out of a drapery satin. First, place your pattern pieces and cut out your fabric. Here I use just the standard polyester lining. I base the organza layer and the crinkle layer together and serge them so they'd be fairly easy to work with. Cut out two pieces for the collar. One of them being interfaced. The pieces for the body, I've already done the darts and pressed them towards the center. Same with the main fabric. Then there are the sleeves. Here is the arm opening. I surged everything. First, sew the side and shoulder seams together of the lining. Repeat with the main fabric. So you've made two little vests. For the collar, with right sides together, sew the top seam. Flip, and then press with your iron. Lining up the centers, sew the collar onto the outside fabric. Find the center of the back and mark it with a pin. Do the same with the lining. Match the two pins and pin together, sandwiching the collar in between. Pin along the rest of the collar, carefully matching up the shoulder seams. Sew them together along the collar. Once that's done, flip them both to right sides out and press. Next, match up and pin the key seams together. including armholes. Then sew the raw edges together. To make the sleeves, it's cut two on fold. There is a place for your hand to come out, and there is a marking on the paper pattern. I've marked the location with a pin. 
There's another marking on the other side of the sleeve. I've marked that with a pin as well. With right sides together, sew around the sleeve from pin to pin. Once that's done, you'll have this odd little piece that is not sewn. Don't forget to clip your corners. Here I've sewn the raw edge down so that that is where the hand hole is. Flip it right sides out and press it with your iron. Make the bias tape. For the instructions on that and how to use it, see the bias tape video. There's a link in the description. Cover all the raw edges of the vest with your bias tape. Cover the armhole of the sleeve's raw edge with the bias tape leaving that odd little bit free. Take that odd bit and pin it to the bottom edge of the armhole to the vest, matching your seams. and sew together. Then cover the remaining raw edge of the armhole in bias tape. And you're done.